Hello and welcome, I'm Michelle Percival of Percival Property and welcome to this week's Percival Property Weekly Update. Now our open for business videos, free to the community, have been an amazing success. We've been able to do some incredible videos and we're still doing those for the community out there at large at the moment. And what I think what's so, what's so wonderful is, is just the stories of how these businesses are surviving, the, what they're actually contributing to the community at large, and uh, it really is heartfelt, and uh, it's wonderful to be able to help these incredible businesses. So our incredible and very busy social media team, headed by Michael Wilkie and Chris Rockstoff as well, have been aiming to create one video a day for all of the businesses that have put forth their submissions. And this week we've shot five videos, so one every single day we're launching this week. Now, Blue Cow Gelato, if you love ice cream, and I know my grandchildren and my family love ice cream, come and try this amazing product. Uh, Donna, who runs Blue Cow Gelato, has got some fantastic flavours. Uh, great to have an ice cream on a Sunday afternoon if you're going for a walk and you're doing your exercise but make sure you have a beautiful ice cream afterwards. Now, women's raw strength. Claire and Peter run this incredible business and uh, they've been donating their services for free, uh, doing online training with no charge. How incredible is that? They've been donating meals within the community and Peter is also a returned ex-serviceman. So what an incredible gift to give people and still giving. So. We love to support this incredible business. Bago Maze and Winery. Now this is three generations of the Mobs family here and we just love this business. What an incredible surrounds and it really demonstrates what a, such a beautiful uh, valley the Hastings Valley is. Take a look at this incredible business. So last Friday night, if you love fish and I do, the Burger Rebellion teamed up with Whalebone Wharf. What a combination. And they created these absolutely scrumptious, beautiful fish burgers. Now this is going to become a regular event, we're told. You're going to have a wonderful chef each week that's going to create an outstanding new burger. So Friday night, Burger Rebellion, let's go and see what they've got to offer. So tonight, what have we got in store for you? Well, the Little Shack Cafe is going to feature tonight. Now, of those of you who don't know where that is, it's on the beautiful Town Beach Precinct foreshores there. Your morning coffee, how about you try them this week? Give them a go, give them some business, and uh, enjoy the beautiful walk along our extraordinary foreshore, and uh, enjoy your coffee, and uh, maybe something sweet as well. I think what's been the most amazing part of this journey is just exploring all these amazing businesses that Port Macquarie has to offer. Once we've shot all these incredible businesses, we're gonna have an amazing library that we can share with all of you so that if you're at a loss to do what you wanna do over the weekend, there is so much to do in Port Macquarie. Shop local, buy local, and support our local community because that's what we love to do. So what's happening in our real estate world this week? Well, there's lots. Now we're super excited. We're actually now allowed to do open homes. They're obviously going to be run very, very carefully in accordance with the government guidelines. But Saturday, I'm on my first open home. I'm so excited. I've got lots of groups booked in to see 14 The Cottage Way. And uh, we would love to see you out this weekend. There's plenty of bookings left. Go online, have a look at what we've got to offer. Call any of our sales team, we're all available to show you. We've got a, an amazing array of properties available this weekend. So how's the market travelling? I get asked that question on a regular basis at the moment and I've got to say to you that I think the Port Macquarie real estate market is travelling incredibly well. We're still getting enormous volumes of inquiry, we've got great sales going through. There's a lot of energy out there in the market and I've got to say, this week, my phone has been as busy as it's been on a normal weekday and that's how I know how, how everything's tracking because um, when your phone heats up as a real estate agent, 
and you're getting lots and lots of calls, there's lots of activity going on out there. So I'm excited to move forward in this market that we have and we are so lucky as an industry to continue trading through these very, very tough times and being able to provide this incredible service to our vendors, our landlords, our tenants, our, our purchasers as well. Day. And that's a really special day for myself, my daughter, my new daughter-in-law who's about to be a mum in September for the very first time, for all of our family and I know for all of our staff and their mums and all the mums out there, grandmas, and it's going to be a little different for me this year. I'm not going to see my beautiful grandchildren or be with my son or my daughter. Probably the first time in my life I haven't spent time with them, so I'm going to miss them, but we're going to have a, a beautiful Zoom lunch together and uh, play lots of silly games. And certainly it's going to be a Mother's Day with a difference, but still the meaning's there. And from myself to you out there, happy Mother's Day. Enjoy the day with your family and make it special for your mum. I know if my mum were here, I'll be making it very special, but I'm going to enjoy it anyway. So I'm going to leave you with these incredible sunrise shots that were taken this morning by our incredible social media team of Michael Wilkie and Chris Rockstock. Wow, do they give Port Macquarie at its best. And I'm going to make you all very envious all over the world when you see these incredible shots. Take care, have a wonderful week ahead. I'll see you next week.